I will come and see you every day. Come in! Is this the land? Yes. By order of the Landrechter, Ludwig van Beethoven has been appointed the legal guardian of his nephew Karl, owing to the low moral character of his mother, Johanna van Beethoven. Rights of visitation for the mother will be at the discretion and convenience of the legal guardian. Maybe we should have to find someone who could cook. She has a swinish face anyway. Were you taught music? Yes. I have a gift for you. You shall be a musician. I want to be a soldier. A composer? No, a soldier. Oh. I gave my first concert when I was your age. And I was terrible. Your grandfather thought that he was going to make a fortune out of me as a child prodigy like Mozart's old man. <laughs> but I was pig-headed. I wouldn't play that tingly, pretty stuff that was in vogue then. But the keyboards of the day were not up to it. The first time I played at court, I broke four strings. Hey, Beethoven! The boy is hardly a Mozart, is he? I was 12, but father told them I was nine. of consumption and I became the head of the family your papa I loved most of all 
as I love you, my dear car. His eyes shone with joy when he looked at the boy. All the love in his rich and deep nature seemed to concentrate on this boy. There was no more tender father. You should hear him play. Is going to be a great virtuoso. You spoil him. Schindler tells me you've written nothing. Well, I have no time. And besides, all the servants that Schindler sends me are scoundrels. You're impossible. <laughs> Perhaps. <laughs> you and I. Good Carl. Not replace the son that you lost. 